Hello. All right, you are here to learn about healthcare data analytics. Yes, you will learn that just stick with me and please don't forget to subscribe. So let's imagine walking into a hospital. Doctors are diagnosing patients. Nurses are rushing to administer care. And in the background, something invisible is working nonstop. Data. Every test, every prescription, and every hospital visit creates valuable information. But how do we make sense of it all? That's where healthcare data analytics comes in. Let's take a closer look at how data is transforming healthcare one insight at a time. Think of healthcare data analytics as a detective. It takes raw, messy medical data and turns it into meaningful insights. You must be wondering what I meant by that healthcare analytics turns raw and unorganized data into meaningful insights. Yes, let me tell you how. Every day, hospitals, clinics, and healthcare providers collect massive amounts of data, patient records, test results, treatment histories, and more. However, having data isn't enough. To truly make an impact, we need to analyze this data and turn it into useful information. That's where healthcare analytics comes in. It helps organizations understand past trends, predict future outcomes, and make informed decisions about patient care. From the collected data, healthcare analytics answers three critical questions. First one we will talk about is descriptive analytics. So, before we can improve anything, we need to understand what has already occurred. Descriptive analytics organizes and summarizes historical data, providing a clear picture of past trends. Example, a hospital might analyze past admission records to determine how many patients were admitted last month. Now we will talk about predictive analytics. Once we understand the past, the next step is to predict future outcomes. By using advanced statistical models and machine learning, Predictive analytics identifies patterns and forecasts what is likely to happen next. Example, can we predict which patients are at risk for readmission based on their medical history, lifestyle, and treatment plans? Now the last question healthcare analytics answer is what should we do about it? So far we know what happened, what will happen, and now what should we do about the information we know? Understanding the future is helpful, but knowing what actions to take is even more powerful. Prescriptive analytics goes beyond predictions by providing specific recommendations to improve outcomes. For example, if we know which diabetes patients are at high risk for complications, prescriptive analytics can suggest the most effective treatment plans based on past success rates. With these three types of analytics, healthcare providers can move from just collecting data to making proactive, data-driven decisions, improving patient care, reducing costs, and increasing efficiency. Now, let's talk about where this data comes from. Every second, healthcare systems generate massive amounts of data. Some of the key sources include 1. Electronic health records, EHRs, digital medical records containing patient history. 2. Medical devices and wearables, devices like heart monitors and smartwatches tracking vitals. 3. Insurance claims data, billing and treatment records from insurance companies. 4 public health databases, government, and research organizations collecting disease trends. But raw data is just the beginning. Before we can analyze it, we need to clean it up. Yup, you got it right. We scrub the data just like that. But why do we do that? Imagine you're analyzing patient records, but some entries are missing ages, others have duplicate names, and some have incorrect diagnoses. Messy data leads to bad decisions. That's why data cleaning is one of the most crucial steps in analytics. Key processes include removing duplicate records, filling in missing values, standardizing formats, eliminating errors. Once our data is clean, we can start exploring and visualizing it. That's the fun part. Yes, data visualization, bringing numbers to life, data without visualization is like a puzzle without a picture. Tools like Tableau, Power BI, and Python help us create dashboards that reveal trends at a glance. Let's look at an example. A hospital wants to track infection rates. A simple bar chart shows spikes in flu cases during winter, insight that helps allocate resources better. But visualization is just the beginning. What if we could predict future health trends? That's where machine learning comes in. Predicting the future with machine learning. Imagine a system that analyzes thousands of patient histories and predicts who might develop heart disease in the next five years. 
Machine learning models do exactly that. They identify patterns we might not even notice. Real-world applications include predicting hospital readmissions, identifying at-risk patients for chronic diseases, optimizing staff and bed allocation. To excel in this field, you'll need the right tools and skills. Now let's talk about some essential tools for healthcare data analytics. SQL for handling large healthcare databases. Python and R for advanced statistical analysis and machine learning. Tableau and Power BI for creating powerful visualizations. SAS used for predictive analytics in healthcare research. Now, let's wrap it up with some key takeaways. One, healthcare data analytics helps make better decisions. Two, data cleaning and visualization are crucial steps. Three, predictive analytics and machine learning can improve patient outcomes. Four, essential tools for healthcare data analytics. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please don't forget to subscribe below.